community aids continuously, providing relief aids for the storm-hit areas. On Saturday, two MD-11 aircraft loaded with tanks, foodstuffs, blankets, medicines and tablets weighing 143.193 tents donated by the Keen and people of Saudi Arabia arrived at small hours at 11.35 a.m. and 12 aircraft carrying 11.97 tents of water purification units and accessories donated by the Emergency Relief Agency in Sweden at 1.50 a.m. 5C-130 aircraft carrying plastic sheets, a lifeboat, water bottles weighing 55.816 tents donated by the United States of America at 9.03 a.m., 9.58 a.m., 11.20 a.m., 12.10 p.m. and 4.10 p.m., IL-76 aircraft carrying health facilities, mosquito nets, water gut tablets, packets, water barrels and filters weighing 24.445 tons donated by WFP at 11.25 a.m. and a 300 aircraft carrying 37.86 tons of plastic sheets, Donated by Relief Supplies Company Limited in Britain at 2 p.m. respectively at the Yango International Airport. Relief Supplies donated by international community are continuously arriving by A and C. These relief supplies are systematically accepted at the airports and jetties by relief supplies acceptance committees and are promptly sent to the victims in the storm hit areas by helicopters, cars, and vessels. With sincere goodwill and deep sympathy based on national spirit, summit of fair needs and well wishes from respective states and divisions are providing cash and kind assistance for the storm victims. Well wishes from Shen State North donated over 20.77 million chips worth, clothes, foodstuff, and consumer goods. Shen State South 748,100 chips in cash and relief supplies. Moan Kayan State over 12.89 million chips in cash. Sakai Division over 10.57 million chips in cash. Manali Division 3.4 million chips worth, 200 beds of chemical fertilizers, and clothes for the storm victims. On Saturday alone, 50.38 million jets in cash and kind donation, including over 1.99 million jets donated at finance acceptance and disbursement trap committee, has received. In all total, the cash and kind donations amount 10,649.28 million jets up to 31st May. Chairman of Tribert Tide Corp. Group TCG, comprising three representatives each from the government of the Union of Myanmar, ASEAN, and the United Nations Deputy Minister for Foreign Affairs Uchotu, received Singaporean Ambassador to the Union of Myanmar, Mr. Robert Chu Hin Khan and Party of TCG, which was formed to assist relief and rehabilitation programs for the storm victims on Saturday at Chiming Hall of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. On the occasion, they discussed matters relating to cooperate in relief and rehabilitation tax for the storm victims. Deputy Regional Director at the Directorate of Southeast Asia Region of WHO, Dalto Punen Tathkrabalt Singh and Party, together with WHO Resident Representative Professor Adik Vipovo, paid a courtesy call on Deputy Minister for Health Dr. Miao at the Ministry's office in the Gong Township on 30th May. At the meeting, the Deputy Minister discussed matters relating to healthcare services of the people in the storm hit regions in cooperation with WHO and future cooperation plans. While wishes from home and abroad are continuously donating cash and kind for the storm hit areas. On 31st May, Chairman of Finance Receiving and Disbursement Chef Committee, Deputy Minister for Finance and Revenue, Garner La Ping Sui, accepted cash assistance for the cyclone victims, donated fine well wishes at donation receiving department of the Central Bank of Myanmar, Yangon Branch, of the Ministry of Finance and Revenue in Yangon Township, Yangon Division. It is planned that the donations amount over 1.99 million jets and 32,042. 2.3 US dollars on Saturday. Another arrangement of the Ministry of Health and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the first batch of Thai medical units provided healthcare services to the storm victims of Miao Mia and Labuda townships by stationing in a Penny Tayo Monastery in Miao Mia from 18th to 28th May. On 28th May, they related 
their experiences to officials and the MR medical team and the Thai medical unit led by Dr. P. Chit Siriwan, who are currently in Myanmar as the second batch. The first batch gave medical treatment to 3,768 victims at 20 relief camps and 168 minor operations raised health awareness, killed and counseled those who were in despair, participated in disease prevention and environmental sanitation tasks, assisted in the activities of retrieving safe water and for personal hygiene and donated medicines and medical equipment to relief camps. So much for now. Stay with us.